today we are talking about one of my favorite things ever and that is outerwear i love a good maxi sweater a good jacket like that is so my vibe so i am going to show you and try on all of my favorite outerwear at the moment we're giving trendy we're giving also lots of range because i live in atlanta and i feel like here during the winter especially you've got to be prepared for everything one day it'll be like 60s the next day it'll be like 20s and you just gotta have that, that good range like i'll be showing you one of my like winter really winter-esque heavy duty coats but also like the lighter outerwear that's like just more chill, more comfy for when it's not as freezing outside. So basically, I am just showing off all my favorite outerwear. I'm trying them on, I'll tell you where I got them and why I love them so much. So let's just go ahead and get into it. All right, so first up, we gotta talk about this sweater. This is a maxi chocolate brown sweater that I am obsessed with. Like, this is beautiful. You can see it's true maxi. I know some maxi sweaters kind of and like right here a little awkwardly but this one is a true maxi it goes all the way to the floor i love to lounge around in this at home if i'm feeling a little chilly in the house or even just love to you know if i'm gonna go run errands i'll even throw this on to feel a little bit extra i will say that you either want to wear either heels or some chunky sneakers so that you get a little bit of extra height because if you are gonna take this out on the road this thing is gonna be dragging on the floor. So that's the one thing, but it is especially great for lounging around when you're in the house. So I got this from a store that I just recently found called Cosmios. Very cool, lots of stuff, very much my style, like comfy but still chic, simple but put together. You know what I mean? And I just, I love all of their stuff. There are a couple other items that I'm gonna be sharing with you from there. But yeah, this is one of my favorites, also color. Hello, brown. Y'all know how much I love neutrals and browns and just earth tones in general are really my vibe and just, yeah, I am obsessed. Oh, quickly, if we wanted to note my little outfit on the inside of my outerwear, this is what I'm gonna be wearing with every piece of outerwear that I show you. But these are the 30 years biker shorts. Obsessed, okay? I know we're not talking about biker shorts in this video, but just know I'm obsessed and then this I believe is just a regular crop top I believe I got this from forever 21 so very very simple y'all know biker shorts are my vibe but yeah this is basically one of currently my favorite oversized chunky maxi sweaters all right so next we got to talk about plaid I've got a couple other plaid um shackets I guess you will call it that I want to show you guys but this is one of my favorites this is from Old Navy okay so nice I don't usually actually shop at Old Navy I just shop for my boyfriend there because I finally really have really nice men's stuff but I'm not usually a super huge fan of the female stuff besides their active wear but I was actually shook when I saw this shacket if you don't know what a jacket is, it's like a shirt jacket combination. It's not really as thick as a regular jacket, but it's not definitely not as thin as a regular shirt. So my vibe, I love this little hybrid combo. I also love um, the length of this jacket. I would say, is it midi? Like would we call this a midi length? You know how you have midi dresses? It's a little bit oversized. This is actually a size small. Usually I will need to size up, just generally, I will size up to a medium to make something a little bit more oversized. But this is actually a size small. It's oversized in its own right. And I love it. Also, hey tones, neutrals. <laughs> Y'all know that's my vibe, right? So I just think it's absolutely perfect. Honestly, I haven't actually worn this full outfit on its own yet, but I need to. So if y'all see me re-wear this entire fit on Instagram, pretend like you've never seen it before because this is cute. So here is another plaid jacket, but maxi style. I would still call this maxi, even though it's not, or maybe midi. We call this maxi or midi, I don't know. It's a long jacket, okay, and I love it. So this is actually another purchase from that new place I was mentioning called Cosmios. This is actually a size small, so it's actually pretty big for a size small, but the thing is I love, I love an oversized fit. I love anything that's kind of comfy and I guess we could call this like shabby chic. It's a whole vibe. I love, 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 love the color. That's my favorite thing about it, okay? This blue is such a nice blue, something that you can wear obviously just with what I have on, like bike shorts and a crop top, but also with like all black fit, maybe with some leggings. You could throw this on with some denim and it would be a vibe with like a, a monochromatic blue kind of look, you know what I mean? So there's definitely options with this jacket and I love it. It's very different from anything else that I have in my closet as well. So another kind of thing where I feel like when I put this on, it's like, boom! 
boom, I'm popping out in something like special, something different than you're usually used to seeing me in. So I love it. I did just recently get this. So again, I haven't gotten to put an outfit together in this. So y'all are really getting kind of like a first look at some of these shackets that I have yet to style on Instagram yet, but let's believe it's coming soon. Okay, so green is another color that I have been really, really loving lately, especially as Christmas is kind of coming around. This is probably the most lightweight shacket that I've shown you so far. It's literally like just a teensy bit thicker than your normal button down shirt, but I love it. My favorite thing about this, again, is the colors. I actually snagged this from another new store called Lioness. Everything, by the way, that I mentioned in here will be tagged as usual in the description box below. This color, obsessed. So this is a size small and this looks like a true size small. Um, I would have probably liked for this to be a little bit bigger, but I still love it. I still really, really love it. When I got it, I didn't feel like going through the process of like returning and then waiting and blah, blah, blah. like no, I just wanted to wear it right away because I just, I'm obsessed with the color. Okay, and then one more plaid, okay? This is the last plaid jacket that I have to show you guys. Love this. This one I actually picked up from Zara. I feel like now that I have it on, usually I wear it kind of like rolled up like this. That's my favorite way to wear this one especially. Um, but I don't know if it's like shrinking in the wash, but like you guys can see that the arms are looking real short. It really doesn't matter to me. Everywhere else fits really good. Honestly though, I feel like this used to fit me bigger. What's going on? So this is actually a shacket that I've been wearing a lot. So maybe, I don't know, maybe I've been wearing it a little bit too much and my dryer is probably starting to shrink it because it's, it's giving a little teeny tiny. But yes, I do love this. I feel like years ago, I used to wear black all the time, like all the time. Black was my thing. Now it's like nude is a new black, okay? Just look at how put together this looks. Even though this is a very, very basic-esque kind of outfit, it's just a crop top, bike shorts, and a shabby kind of shirt on top. But look at how put together it looks just because it's like a family of neutrals that are all vibing together. You know what I mean? Like I am just, such a fan of neutrals and honestly if you've been feeling like you want to look a little bit more put together i'm telling you my top tip get you a bunch of neutrals and put together some neutral monochromatic looks 50 shades of nudes y'all 50 shades all right so in speaking of neutrals i wanted to show you guys two of my favorite like neutral jackets this is the first one actually i'm not sure like do we call this a jacket do we call it a sweater i don't know what we call it but it is fire okay it's one of those with like the wing looking sleeves i don't know what it is about these kind of things with the wing ones but they just look so good the way it just sits on the body the fabric is just kind of slouching but it looks it looks sharp to me in my opinion so i've actually rolled up the sleeves this is how i wear it sometimes i scrunch it up like this when i'm out and yes, of course, we do got the pockets. <laughs> and y'all, this is super comfy, okay? This is another Zara find. I feel like my camera here is picking up the true color of it. It's just a really nice, warm kind of neutral, and I love it. It goes with everything. I also love this collar detail that it has on the top. It just, this is the part I feel like that makes it look really smart and put together. But then everything about it is also very casual at the same time, and I love that. I love the kind of contrast that this entire jacket is giving. I love it, love it, love it, love it. So it's actually very warm. This is a, not super thick, but it is a kind of thick material. It's not scratchy or anything though. Very, very comfortable to wear. And as you can see, it is still very movable. So it's not like stiff or anything. I know if you're watching and you do follow me on Instagram, y'all have seen me wear this multiple times, okay? Love it. All right, so this is the other neutral jacket that I wanted to show you guys. This is a blazer, an oversized blazer. I purposely got it in a size medium so it could look really big and oversized on me. I'm obsessed. <laughs> this is probably one of my favorite blazers at the moment. I have a lot of blazers that are plaid, have designs on them, but this is my first neutral, like solid, oversized blazer and I love it. So when it comes to styling, one thing that I love to do is do a style that showcases a little bit of a contrast. And so this right here is what this outfit is giving. So it's giving athletic, comfy vibes, but also put together and she means business. So that contrast to me is like so vibey. So this is this is a fit y'all gonna see me wear again, and again, and again, and again, because this is cute. And this is very, very neat. I mean, as good as this outfit looks right here, there are so many other ways 
to dress up this blazer as well, which is why it's currently one of my favorite pieces in my closet. You can do boyfriend jeans, you can do flare jeans, you can do it with a dress. The options are endless when it comes to this jacket, and I just genuinely feel like this is one of those staples that everybody needs to have in their closet. All right, so now that we've done my neutrals, let's talk a little bit about some pops of color. It's not often that I do pops of colors, but when I do, I do it in a maxi lightweight cardigan, honey. Mm, mm, mm. This is giving. This is actually so cute. So this was another find at Cosmios, one of my new favorite stores. When I saw this jacket, I was like, oh my gosh, have to have it. So I feel like, you know, with the biker shorts, it is a fit, but I also envision this a lot with leggings, maybe stuff that are a little bit longer, um, boyfriend or mom jeans. This just adds a little bit of spice and also warmth to your outfit. And it's cute. It is so cute. I love the fact that it came with this because I feel like this tie thing gives it more of a casual vibe. So I feel like the sweater itself looks very kind of straight and like almost professional in a way, but because it is a flowy maxi sweater and it's got this tie, it's still giving very comfy and relaxed and nah, I really didn't actually try too hard with this. You know what I mean? You catch my drift? I love it. And of course I also have earth toned pop of color items. I mean, <laughs> hello orange. Orange is something that I discovered in 2021. I have trademarked it and it belongs to me now. I love orange on me. It's just giving, especially this burnt orange. This is more like a rust kind of orange. So perfect for fall. Fall is kind of on its way out of here. Fall is kind of gone, bye bye. It's like winter, but I'm gonna still be wearing this because it's so cute. So this works well as a layering item actually to wear like a, a heavier duty coat over it would be so cute. Actually, let me show you. Okay, so boom. Y'all feel me? Y'all see the vibe? This is first of all extremely warm. So obviously this is great. Perfect for layering. Now let's get into this coat for a little bit. I was going to show you guys this separately, but because we started talking about layering, I just had to put it on and show y'all the deal. So this is my favorite, my favorite heavy duty winter coat for those days that either A, I'm just trying to be extra extra or B, it's actually really butt cold outside here in Atlanta. We do have those random couple of days where it drops pretty low. So I like to have this on hand and I also, ugh, okay, first of all, the color, y'all already know. Y'all already know, this is my color. That chocolate brown is so me right now. It's just everything. Y'all have seen me actually style this coat already with bike shorts as well, even without the layer. Let me kind of tuck it in a little bit so y'all can get a little bit of the vibe. See, like even without the layer underneath, this is still a vibe, especially with bike shorts. I love, I love, I love this coat. With bike shorts, so cute. So remember when I was talking about that contrast? So again, we've got, I might be working out or I might just be chilling, you don't know, but boom, now nah, we are fashionable, we are put together. So that's kind of what this coat gives. All right, and last but certainly not least is a super casual, just extra lightweight, super comfortable pop of color jacket. This is another moment from Old Navy and I love it. I got this in a medium so it could be a little bit more oversized and comfy. It is super lightweight and it's actually pretty warm. It's that Sherpa kind of material and I love it. It's cute or whatever. You know what I like to do with this jacket is actually match it with an outfit inside that is like either the same color or a similar color as the jacket itself. Whoo, monochromatic vibes with this jacket. So nice. Like I have these leggings here and a matching bra in this color, also from Old Navy. And when you wear this together, ooh, it's a whole, it's a whole vibe. You look expensive and it is so cute. So there are definitely ways to kind of dress up this outfit, make it look a little bit more put together because it is, it is pretty, it's pretty shabby, but it's so comfy that I just had to include it here because it is genuinely one of my favorites. So yeah, what do we think? What do we think? Those are currently my favorite outerwear pieces at the moment. Most of them, I would say, because if I sat here and tried to share every single piece with you, we would be here all day. I am obsessed with outerwear. I have so many and I'm also, I'm also always constantly buying more and also selling more on my Poshmark. Just keep an eye on there because 
when I wear them and then I'm like, okay, this is like kind of overworn, time to move on to the next thing, I'll just put it up on my Poshmark for the low low and somebody else can be super happy with it. You know what I mean? I love that for you, love that for me, love that for everybody. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey guys, I hope you guys are enjoying Listmas so far. Don't forget, you know, if you see any little weird pop-ups in these Listmas videos, it might be worth your while to just take a little note. You never know. Might help you out in the long run. <laughs> but yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. I will catch you tomorrow for the next one. Bye.